Is it over here? How about over here? Here, how about over here? It's there? Are you sure it's that one? Are you sure? Even in a small amount of disease in a bee colony, Clinker's gonna detect that long before a human would ever detect it. Clinker inspects bees for the odor of American foulbrood. It's a very contagious disease that bees get. Oh, good girl. Clinker is the only certified dog in the continental United States, probably Alaska and uh, Hawaii, that is certified to detect American foul brood. Okay, day's over. A good working dog has to have a little bit of home time, a little bit of downtime, a little bit of play time. She enjoys her downtime around the house being just a household pet. Keep that old stupid toy. It's that old stupid toy. Are you gonna give stupid toy to me? Uh, I'm not gonna give that to me. But she enjoys the time when she gets to go work. Okay. Okay. Anything? Come here, 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 here. Come here, come here. Good girl. American foul brood is a bacterial disease of the brood, not the adult bees. The disease leaves behind a very contagious spore that infects all the combs, all the woodenware, any equipment that it comes in contact with. Well, American foul brood has been around seemingly forever. Maryland state law, as is, is with most state laws, is that they burn those colonies. So from an economical standpoint, commercially, you want to keep that American foul brood under wraps and keep a close watch on that. The Maryland Department of Agriculture has had a dog program since 82. We know the effectiveness of it. We certainly are going to try to employ more dogs throughout the here? state to help us be more okay. efficient. We're gonna go to the next place. We're gonna go to the next bee yard. Okay, good girl. Good job. Good job, Clay. Good job, yeah. You did good girl. 